Hey guys, this is Nessie. Have you ever tried to reinstall Final Fantasy XIV only to realize you had to spend hours to rebuild your gear sets, macros, and UI before you could even play the game? I recently went through this myself after building a new computer, so today I'm going to show you how to copy over those settings. One thing I want to stress to you is that this first step needs to be done prior to uninstalling your current Final Fantasy XIV. If you have already uninstalled, wiped your hard drive, thrown your PC out a window, etc., there's nothing left for you to do but to take the time to set everything back up. Get on your old computer or open your launcher before you uninstall Final Fantasy. When you go to the launcher, the first thing we're going to do is click the cog wheel in the upper right hand corner of the screen. This is the configuration menu. Click on config and scroll down to backup. Click on backup and it's going to bring up a pop-up. Backup or restore user interface settings including hotbars, HUD layout, and character configuration. It's going to tell you to make sure an external storage device or USB should be connected prior to proceeding. This is not necessary unless you want to save the config file we're going to make directly to an external drive. You can save this file anywhere, just make sure you save it to a place you can easily find. Click on backup and it will bring up a save window. Do not change the file name. Pick the location you want to save the backup file and click save. This will bring up a confirmation window. Click OK and it will tell you backup successful. Click OK and this step is done. Now you can see, if I open up my documents folder, the .fea file is there. If you're transferring your files to a new computer, you can copy this onto a USB drive if you did not do that when you saved the file. If you're uninstalling Final Fantasy XIV, you are OK to do so now. If you're finding this video helpful, hit the like button so it can be shared with more people. Once Final Fantasy is finished with its fresh install, open the launcher back up again and go back to config. Scroll back down to backup and click on it. This time we are first going to make sure we uncheck do not overwrite older data. If we leave this checked, it will not overwrite the current fresh settings that were just installed and there will be no change to your character data. After you uncheck the box, click restore, find where you saved the FEA file, and click open. This will have you confirm that you want to restore settings. Click OK, and it will tell you settings successfully restored. Now you can log into the game as normal, and all of your macros, gear sets, and UI customization will be present. Let me know in the comments if I missed anything. This is Nessie, and as always, take care of yourself.